Beat Saber turns one year old today. I can't believe time flies by so fast. Looking back at my first video ever, it was uploaded on May 6th, but it still reminds me of the first days that I, when I first started playing Beat Saber. Before I even had anything on YouTube, I was just your average gamer, and I uploaded Beat Saber, all the while having a part-time job at Starbucks and uh, also going to school. I never thought of anything would come out of Beat Saber. I never thought that Beat Saber would be the game that changes my entire life. The footage that you're seeing right now is Beat Saber's first ever build that the Beat Saber devs publicly released for everyone to play. And playing this build just reminds me of the first time I've ever played Beat Saber. And it's also crazy to see how much the game has grown since then. I'm honestly very surprised to see that I'm even over 100,000 subscribers and that I have a check mark next to my name. That's just something I've never thought that would happen. But hey, it's because of you guys, I'm able to do Twitch and YouTube full time. Whether you're a subscriber since the beginning or you've watched every single one of my videos after you subscribed, I truly do appreciate it. Now, just real quick, I just want to throw this in here because I feel like it's pretty important to let you guys know how I feel and how things have been going for me. April has been a pretty rough month for me in terms of uh, viewership on Twitch and view count on YouTube. And I know, it, I don't wanna sound like it's all about view counts or, or, or viewerships or subscribers or numbers. It's not all about that. But to an extent, I do care because it lets me know what I'm doing right and what I'm doing wrong. I'm not trying to sound selfish, but seeing those numbers go down kind of takes a toll. It can be demoralizing for a content creator. Here, I'll give you an example. You know that feeling when you're playing a competitive game and for 10 matches in a row, you're doing so well, you're like, dude, this is really easy. I'm doing really awesome. But then you lose four matches in a row and it takes a hit on you. It demoralizes you and you start getting pretty upset because you're not winning as much. That's pretty much how I felt all throughout April and it's very, very tough to for any content creator to see numbers go down. Now, I understand that People are busy, you know, they have a life, they have a job, they go to school, and I understand that April's probably the busiest month in, in, any, in any year because that's when, you know, May finals or, or June finals are coming up and you guys are pumping out so much work. I perfectly understand that. I'm trying to tell myself every day that this is only temporary and I really hope that in the future that numbers start looking up again. Ultimately, I just wanna say, Thank you so much, Beat Saber. Thank you so much for everyone involved in the Beat Saber community for making so many mods. Big, big shout out to all the modders that either, whether you've worked on mods previously or you're still work, working on them right now, huge shout out, seriously. These guys are the reason why I'm able to have a good experience. Not only me, but for everyone that's playing Beat Saber, they're, they're able to have a great experience. Thank you to everyone at Beat Games, the creator of Beat Saber, for changing my life, for making something unexpected happen. Beat Saber has evolved over the year, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what happens next year. Thank you guys for watching this video, whether you've been here since the beginning or ever since you subscribed. I really do appreciate it. Whether I keep uploading Beat Saber content or not, I hope that you guys still check out my videos. I really do appreciate it. Oh yeah, one more thing. I've been using Twitter more often, so be sure to follow me there, at Labanda915. And also, I stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash 915 Links are down below in the description. Also, if you like Beat Saber, you can subscribe to my channel for more videos. Seriously, thank you guys for the support, and I'll see you next time. Peace. One thing that I noticed in the first ever Beat Saber build is that the Sabers actually had a swiping sound effect.